Hey everybody, Little B here, and I do apologize for the fact that for episode 4, I wasn't feeling so well, so I did not have any speech in the background. Really, the only thing was just me and Colin talking and swearing like sailors. So I came up with a little bit thing where instead of me talking, I'm going to kind of narrate basically everything that happened, and I hope you guys like it. And starting off with the fact that I broke my axe while I was cutting down the trees and had to make a new one. I then decided to smelt all the iron I had and for some odd reason. I decided to use a stick thinking that was enough to smelt the iron. It wasn't. I then grabbed my coal and decided to use that other than the single stick that burnt down in a second. And after that I got back to mining my tree farm. So I decided to go finish my tree off because, you know, if that tree was standing, I wouldn't be able to live with myself. I then replanted my trees and allowed my intrusive thoughts to take over and started bunny hopping to go mine for the rest of the night. I then made a friend, but unfortunately he wasn't so friendly, so I had to put an end to his terror. R.I.P. Mandy. I looked up as I was having a good meal of watermelon and realized I had some friends in the sky. And then the cowardly lion came and visit because I hid, I mean, he hid in my hot tub the entire night until they went away. I learned that I didn't accept one of my quests, which if I did, I would have had enough to make a bonsai plant, so in the next few clips I decided to make my bonsai plant. I then decided to mine up all my trees and sped it up for you guys because for some reason it took me forever and I know that's not what you guys are here to see. You guys just want to see me embarrass myself. I get it. It's cool. I understand. Said hello to my farm and they did not grow. At this point, I learned that my blossom tree is not giving me blossom wood. It gives me spruce. I checked a second time in hopes that something magical would happen, but nope. I was very pissed. I decided to go throw up some kidney stones in the animal farm. I don't know why, I just thought it was a good idea. I then placed some more chests down because I needed storage. Why? Because I'm a hoarder and I keep everything. Colin then showed me you can jump off your island without dying, but I didn't go for it. Because it doesn't seem like something you could just come back from. When morning came, I uh, chopped down all my trees. I guess you could say I just took care of the morning wood or something. I don't know. I then decided to take the blossom tree out of the bonsai plants since I wasn't going to get blossom wood. And I decided to plant my seed in there instead. 
and hopes to get these long white thing called string. The Cowardly Lion then made another appearance and we decided to watch the snow fall together. The Cowardly Lion then left and I began my nightly chore of putting roof over my string farm. I think the Cowardly Lion had a good idea about staying inside because the phantom swooped down and about took my own life, adding another death to its list upon the Minecraft haters. As I went to go finish the room, Mr. Phantom came back around too. Now fortunately, just like Final Destination, I've managed to skip my death again. Unfortunately, there's no other players here, so I'm the only one online. Till next time, Mr. Phantom. Sadly, the day has come that I've lost my seed to the biggest hole yet. I then did some organizing in my chest because it needed it. Although, it really wasn't much organizing. I just separated the orbs, and that's really it. I then sat here and watched my seeds sprout into a beautiful bush. Finally, I started making something. I don't really know what it is. All I know is it just gets me more seed. 